So guys, so guys, hope I hope you like our fishing video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. When it comes to the freshwater fishermen, no other fish gets quite as much as disdain as the chub. Or if you're a prissy pants, you might call it a fall fish. Today we're gonna find out. Let's see how it goes. Welcome back to the FBM Maine Outdoor Journal. This week I took the kids down the Mattawamkeag River to do a little uh, late summer fishing for some warm water bass, yellow perch, even caught a few river chub. And that's where things changed. Liam says, can we keep the chub? Because we was keeping the yellow perch to eat. I said, oh no, you can't eat them. Them's all soft and muddy. But then he kept putting the questions to me and I got thinking back and I never tried a chub. Do I really know if they're muddy or mushy? So that's where we started the chub challenge. Just follow us along here and we'll show you how it turned out. Big chub. Chub. Liam, you caught a great big old chub. Can I keep the chub, Joe? No, they're awful wormy, muddy things. Hello there, everyone. We made it back from a fun fishing trip today down the river. Caught a bunch of bass, a few pickerel. We've got a few of these nice uh, jumbo size yellow perch. Here, we got uh, five of those. So we're going to uh, flay those out and uh, maybe have a nice fish sandwich tomorrow. So uh, let's fly out a couple and see how things go. Liam caught a pretty decent sized chub, or I think the official name's fall fish, out of the river. River chub. And uh, he asked me right away if he could keep it. And I said, oh no, you don't want to keep them, they taste just like mud. And he says, why, have you ate one before? And I got thinking, I said, no, everybody always told me they taste like mud, but I never actually tried one. So we're going to go ahead and give one a test. We're going to... Uh, Try to keep him not over seasoning him so we can really see what his uh, meat texture and taste is like. We're going to uh, scale him, leave the skin on, give him light seasoning, put him on the grill, and we're going to give him a good test. So we'll see 
how bad Chubb really are. What do you think, Liam? I think they might taste delicious. <laughs> delicious? On a sandwich. It might taste delicious. All right, let's do it. scaled up, cleaned out, we'll give him a wash out. See how he tastes. to taste test this job yeah everybody gives them a bad rap mm -hmm. gotta see it looks pretty tasty with that black pepper up a little basting of butter mm -hmm. should I put us off a little piece here to try sure try to get your piece without any bones in it huh? mm. hot on the dickens mm -hmm. One little bone there. Blow on if it's too hot. What do you think? It's hot, but it's delicious. It is delicious? Doesn't mm -hmm. taste muddy? Nope. Nice white flaky meat on there. Nice white flaky meat. Delicious? Nothing wrong with that. That's just as mild as can be. Mm-hmm. What's the problem with these people? This was caught right out of a warm water river right at the end of August. And water he, warm. And people keep saying they're muddy. Hmm. Nice white flaky meat. Mm-hmm. Good. Just have to get all the bones off. Yeah. Want to try another piece? Sure. Bow on it. It's hot. Easy, don't blow it everywhere. Too hot, but it's yummy. <laughs> too hot? Way too hot. You gotta blow on it a little longer. And we got this big yellow perch. Well, we've only ate one of them, but I gotta say it was delicious. It wasn't mushy, it wasn't muddy, it tasted like a nice, sweet, white, flaky fish. I don't understand all the problems. Maybe we gotta start keeping job instead yep. of parrot. We'll okay. have to test out a couple more, see how it goes. Yep. So we might check out the ones in our home. We give it two thumbs, two thumbs way up. 